Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you've never seen my face before, my name is Fortune. I am a certified professional makeup artist and I also really love lipsticks. I just wanted to sit down, chit chat, talk about the Charlotte Tilbury Iconic Nude mini lip wardrobe because I bought it on Sephora. I did a little shorts video. I will link that right here. I'm actually wearing one right now. I'm wearing um, the red carpet red paired with a lip liner. In the swatches, I didn't pair them with a lip liner because I really wanted you guys to see what they look like on the lips. But again, if you wanna see like the video that I put on TikTok, check out my TikTok, my Instagram. But I bought this as, I was gonna say I bought this as a gift, but I bought it for myself, obviously, because I put all the lipsticks on my lips, but I got this really cute box. It has the four lipsticks on the front. It has really cute stars, great packaging. Love Charlotte Tilbury, who doesn't? Just so elegant and chic. This is what it looks like in the packaging. You have four of the lipsticks. Again, these are mini size, and they come in the traditional Charlotte Tilbury retro packaging. Just for comparison, so here we are. Let's go ahead and just show you guys the lip swatches before I give you a really quick review of what I think about each and every color and how they wear. But so first up, Pillow Talk Original, which is a nude pink, which is personally my favorite kind of nude. Any nude that leans a little bit like beigey pink, super flattering for me. This essentially like matches my lip shade. So every time I wear it, it just makes my lips look more pigmented, which is the best kind of nude shade for you. Find one that matches your lips to just enhance them. I can wear this all day long if it does start to fade throughout the day. No one really notices because again, my lip shade underneath matches. So it's going to look pretty cohesive no matter if I decide to reapply or not. This is the lipstick that I wear 95% of the time in my real life, in videos. Pillow Talk Medium is more of a warm berry pink. Definitely has a little bit more brown in it as well. I think this is beautiful for me. I really enjoy like a beigey pink tone nude, but Definitely something I would wear when I'm feeling a little bit moody. I think this would be beautiful on those of you who have a deeper complexion than I do. Walk of No Shame. Now this might be my new favorite lipstick. There is something about this Berry Rose lipstick. All the lipsticks in this set are matte. However, this one kind of has like a sheen to it. Kind of picks up the light differently and like dances in the light super super feminine this is just like the perfect holiday time nude for me and also a lipstick that looks great with my complexion and that i would wear every day no this is not as easy one two three as pillow talk is for me because my lips do not match this lipstick so should it decide to fade throughout the day which these do last a pretty long time but i will say like six hours in they do start to fade i will need to reapply this one Last but not least, we have Red Carpet Red, which guys, when I tried this on the first time, I was not impressed. I kind of just thought it looked like every other red that I own, but oh my God, this is a show stopper. This is beautiful for the holidays, beautiful for date night. This has become my new favorite go-to red. It really brings light and vibrance and brightness to my face and just is such a beautiful, youthful red. I think that, you know, this is a great little set if you wanna try out some Charlotte Tilbury shades. I love the formula. I definitely have realized after owning several of her lipsticks that it's just a brand that I reach for lipsticks constantly. I don't even have to, it's just, honestly, I open up my lipstick drawer, which I have a lot of lipsticks, believe me, and I'm just always picking up my Charlotte Tilbury ones. It's just, I see that packaging. I know it's gonna be a lipstick that has a great undertone that goes with pretty much any kind of makeup look that I threw on or slapped on my face that day. So yeah, just a really great formulation. I love the shape of Charlotte Tilbury's lipsticks in general. Like just the cut of them is so beautiful. But the fact that these are mini, guys, if you have smaller lips, like I don't have really big lips. I also don't have really small lips. I would say I have pretty average lips, okay? But I overdraw the crap out of them. This is like the perfect size to just like line your lip with to really get in there to perfect honestly nothing can perfect a lip shape like a lip liner can in my opinion but just the mininess of this like I said 18 times you can just really get in there I absolutely love it I think the packaging is beautiful very retro you just feel sophistic sophisticated 
just, you know, every time you take it out of your bag. So overall, I think this is a great buy. I would suggest you buying it for yourself, for a loved one. Honestly, you can buy the set and give individuals to people, which is what I'm gonna do, not the ones that I put on my lips. I did show you every color today, but the Pillow Talk shade, I didn't put this one on my lips. I'm gonna save this as a gift to someone for the holiday season, because I don't need it. I literally have three full-size pillow talks because I'm just like that obsessed with them. All right, guys, and that is it. That is my review. I think that this gift set is worth it. I love it. You're gonna love it. If you give it to someone, they're gonna love it. And yeah, make sure that you subscribe if you have not done so yet. I would love to have you. You're gonna click out of this video and think of me in the future and not be able to remember the name of my channel or my name, which is Fortune, which is kind of hard to forget. But, you know, just subscribe this way you never miss a video. Thank you guys so much for joining me and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys. Mwah.